Hi guys, it's Otto from Motorize It, and today I will be showing you the uh, improved version of the Oxymo RTS, which is the Oxymo IO, and how you can reset it to its factory settings, so to its default settings, which is always handy if something goes wrong during the programming process and you need to go back to, uh, to basically blank slate and start from nothing, because it's often easier than trying to find an error and correct it. So what do you need? You need a remote control. In this case it's a smooth origin I.O. Um, it's a one-way uh, remote control and you need the motor itself and you need to be able to turn it on and off of power. Um, I'll show you now how it works. So the first thing to do, and this is similar to an RTS motor, is you take it off power for three seconds. That's one, two, three. Plug it back in. Count to eight. One, two, three. 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8, off again, 1, 2, 3, and we plug it back in, as you see the motor is working now, and what I need to do now is I take remote control, and I only do this when, once the motor has stopped working, and I press the proc button on the back, and I hold it until the motor has responded twice, we've had a first response already, and you wait until you get the second response, and that's it. And now the motor is no longer working on this remote and it's been restored to its factory settings. Um, so you can start again with uh, matching a remote control to it, setting the end limits, etc. Now if you have any questions or if it's not working out, let me know in the comments or you can go to the website which is www.motorize.it. Thank you and see you next time.